am Kaleo Crimson, and this is my EPK. I guess I always knew I wanted to be a recording artist, or at least involved in the entertainment industry in some shape or fashion, even at a very early age. I know a lot of kids go through those stages where they're asked, you know, what they want to do when they're younger, and they say, like, they want to be a fireman or a nurse or something like that. But I always knew that I wanted to be in the entertainment industry, and I was always singing, my mom says I was singing before I could talk, like humming melodies, and I was writing songs, and, and just really, really loved um, entertainment. I, I've pretty much always known, um, I did kind of take a little detour with modeling and with my acting career, um, but I really realized that music is what I truly, truly love the most. My favorite song on the album, gee, um, I, uh, I get asked this one a lot, and it's always difficult to answer. It seems like we're consistently, you know, not to brag, but we're consistently coming up with, with new songs that are even better than the last, and um, we're always, you know, outdoing ourselves, though I, though I still really, really love, you know, even our first song, Mile High Club. Um, it's just, I think, a hit. I would say my personal favorite is probably Repercussions. I just really like the lyrics in it, you know, um, it's kind of about a guy and a girl and uh, it tells a story and I love songs that tell a story um, and basically it just says, you know, to whatever guy you're dating, you know, like whatever you do, there are going to be some repercussions, so you better watch, better watch what you do and I think a lot of girls can relate to that. Well, some of my musical influences, I guess, would have to be number one, Madonna. I just really, really admire her ability to keep reinventing herself. The way that she's stayed in the music game for so long is phenomenal and pretty much unheard of. Um, I love how she performs on stage and just the energy she gives in all of her albums and the way she can think outside the box and just do something that no one ever even thought of and push the boundaries a little bit. I'd also have to say uh, Rihanna because I believe that Rihanna is constantly putting out good music and um, consistently and uh, she has that fun dance type music that you know we're trying to create in this album um, along with uh, Katy Perry who also I think has kind of a fun you know vibe that we're trying to recreate and uh, but on but in our own way um, put into this album I love them both in their own way. I love the recording process. You know, you're coming up with new music and new ideas and, you know, I just, I love that whole creative process. But then again, I mean, the feeling you get on stage in front of all those people and just, you know, the cheers and feeling them, you know, the love coming from the audience is, maybe that is the best because, uh, Nothing really quite beats that other than, you know, it's instant gratification. Well, I feel I have a phenomenal production team. I couldn't be happier um, with this project. Um, first, uh, Eric 88 Fingers Parham. He is one of the producers along with Santiago. Um, Eric has done most of the beats, but Santiago has um, contributed as well, and the music that they have come up with um, together and apart, because they are friends, so some of the stuff they have done together um, is just it's beyond my expectations. So I'm, I'm very, very pleased in that aspect. Also, my songwriting team, um, Layla Martinez and Teos. 
Um, they both have really stepped it up and um, you know, allowed me to even collaborate on a few of the songs, and uh, which I've always wanted to be a songwriter. So um, getting more involved in that has been, you know, another dream come true. And um, I just I love what they're coming up with for this project. Also have the best engineer ever. Um, we're recording here at Hot Beats, and Scotty is the man. So if you ever book here, make sure you go, with Scotty. Um, he is uh, just really taken everything to another level, mixing-wise, and um, just really put his whole heart and soul into it. I can tell he really cares about the project, and that's important, you know. I, I feel that everyone really cares about this project, and um, that's that's very important. Just to keep me, keep just me. to keep me from crying. 